Okay, the unique thing about this snowblower I find is that the engine is mounted sideways compared to most snowblowers. It has a uh, typical auger set up, I guess, but it doesn't have the drive mechanism in the middle and the impeller is behind it and it's a paddle style. I'll flip it over to get more light in it later. The um, drive mechanism, there's a chain along the side that goes to this shaft here, which appears to be missing some type of mechanism, I guess, here to engage this clutch or auger and the impeller inside, the paddle style impeller. Um, this is an engine I bought for cheaper than what the recoil was for the Briggs and Strat motor that was on it, and the Briggs and Strat was smaller. Uh, it's got good tires and chains, and built like a tank, all metal, you know, turret, uh, whatever you call that, a turret, you know, snow thrower, snow tree, whatever. Excuse me if the terminology's wrong, shoot, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, uh, uh, it, as you see, even just by turning the auger with my foot slightly, it shoots snow, let me see if I can do that again, it shoots snow out the, the, uh, out, out the tr snow chute, the greatest of ease. Let's see if I can do that again. Ah, it's hard to do this and hold the camera at the same time. Whatever, you get the idea. Um, so in there, let's flip this up and get some light on it. Inside there, if you can see, is a paddle that goes forward. It actually goes... Actually... Now don't do this with the engine engaged. It actually turns this way and not circular like most of them. The uh, that's the impeller, and that's the jaws. Now I was half tempted just to find a way to gag that clutch system to make it work all the time, and. Uh, just use the belt, engage and disengage, but it uh, would be nice to figure out what part that is. I don't even know what make the snowblower is. Nowhere on it does it have the make. The engine that was on it was a Briggs and Stratton, I believe. It, it might have had something to do with MTD. I'm not 100% sure about that. Uh, it has six gears forward, neutral reverse, which is kind of crazy. Like I said, it has a metal chute. If you look at the brand new ones that are like a thousand bucks and they got a plastic chute. Looks like it'd blow off if a rock went through it. Anyways, um, there's the Princess Auto Motor, similar to other ones you might have seen. Uh, it's getting cold, so I'm going to go inside. But uh, that's pretty much what I'm looking for right around there. Is that, uh, let's see if I can get the snow and ice off of it. Is some kind of system that engages that area.